We are stuck inside a worm's lair. And we need to get out. Do we need a carrot to get out? One day, Junie was weeding her carrot garden. Just then, a ginormous worm appeared. Doesn't look that big compared to the carrot. Okay, those are some big carrots then. Ah! Grr. She sprayed it with her handy dandy worm aside. The worm didn't like this. Surprise, surprise! The worm lunged at her and pulled her into his lair. This is what happened next. Wait. I think I saw a password there. Okay, so four is four. I guess the fourth one that I pressed, three is three. Mm -hmm. Okay, so far... Looks like the password, if there is one, is going to be a regular sequence. Unless this is instructing me how to play, how to play the knit stories and how to how to decipher the passwords. Let's go ahead and walk over here. Six. No, that's not what it's doing. Okay, it's pointing to the left. So six is a zero for this one. So far, hmm. May need to write this down somewhere. I don't know. Where can I write this down? Blank, blank, four, three, blank, zero. I don't have a pen and paper with me, so... Yes, I may need to commit this to memory. Disintegrate already? Thank you. And I'll save. You gonna be that mean? How many of these are there gonna be? Okay. So they're not all over the place, and that one doesn't even have any spikes. So jump over that one. Wait a minute. Okay. That's different. Glowing blue fungus is slippery and will prevent climbing. I see. So, we already know what the th three is. Blank, blank, four, three, blank, zero so far. Glowing green slime is sticky and will prevent walking. So it's the opposite of the fungus. Alright. Up we go. Any more passwords here? Okay, we already know the six, the four, and the three. Up we go. Navigate this. Unless we need more more characters from the password, we might. Okay, so a hologram right there. <laughs> if I decipher the password, I will probably be happy. Hmm. It looks to be inside out now, doesn't it? Hmm. Okay. So I think I see where I gotta go. Let's go this way, into this, and try to find our way out now. Hmm. No, uh, apparently not. It just works us somewhere we've already been. So, eh, yeah, might as well restart the music, just for the sake of convenience, the convenience of listening, and continue up. Navigate this. It's gonna be a little bit confusing. And that was the wrong way. Navigate. Remember. Remember. Okay. So what's outside in, what's inside out? Okay, um, I'll do this. It takes me back here. So how do I get to the hologram, then? Hmm. Yeah, how? More thinking. Thinking cap, remembrance cap. Many other caps. And... Sheesh. Some of this would be easier with the hologram, but no. That's the thing that I have to collect. Oh. Hey! Hey, hey, hey. And I'm all the way back here. So up we go again. Trying to figure this out. You're just teasing me now, aren't you? Aren't you? Whew. What do we do? Hmm. Puzzles, puzzles. Rude. Failed. <laughs> Try this again. Keep, keep on trying. Yeah, maybe that one right there? Right over there? Is that the one, then? Is it the one? No, it isn't. <sighs> Two. I don't remember. Um, so, something, seven, three, four, something, zero. Something, seven, three, four, something, zero. Blank, seven, three, four, blank, zero. Yeah, go up again, maybe? Is that what I would have to do? Oh, God. So confusing, so confusing. Okay, there we go. Now I got the hologram. That makes things a lot easier. You'll send me back? back this way. Now I gotta find my way out. 
on my way out. Somewhat easy. And... Almost there. Almost there. Voila. Good. Ow. As the music resets. Thankfully, I've got something different. What's over this way again? Okay, blank 734, blank 0. Gotta go back to where, where the spiky enemy was. Where I can use the hologram, hopefully. Save. Ow! Laser! Lasered. Hmm. Okay. Good. How do I make it to that? Maybe I don't. Courtesy of invisible spikes. Ooh. Whoa! Oh, you shoot. Um, wait a minute. You work me back. Okay. That's convenient. Ow, that's harsh. That's harsh. Hmm. You're the ghost music, though. What for? Got our double jump now. And save this. By doing that. There we go. In theory, I could go up there too. Just let me shoot at the right time. Sometimes they kill me right where I spawn. And sometimes they don't. So lock up the draw. Now I can just escape from you all together. Yellow key! Please no spikes, please no spikes, please no spikes, please no spikes. And please don't ambush me in the worst way possible. Like that. Up we go. Do this again. Hologram ain't gonna help. Cause just these enemies. We have just these enemies to contend with. And only one of them is affected by the hologram. So, it's not gonna help much. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> such a struggle to get just a single key. You had to make it such a struggle, didn't you? Hmm. Might have been something that an umbrella would fix, although I'm probably gonna be too little too late for that. You shot? You shot? <laughs> good, good, good. Huh. <sighs> no more worrying about that. Ow. Still have to worry about these types of shots, though, but I gotta remember my double jump. Makes things, helps things out a lot. <sighs> now, if only that shooter would cooperate. It's not doing that. So this is a job for the hologram. A definite job for the hologram. Yeah. And now that I know, you seem to have read my mind, because I keep dying to that. Good. Up we go. And what's up there? What's up there? I don't know. Oh! We got a red key somewhere. Now we just gotta make it there. Looks like yet another job for the hologram. Good, good, good. Not nearly as hard as the yellow key, but still somewhat hard. There's bound to be a purple key somewhere, too. Hey, why did I do that? Remember, blank seven three four blank zero so far. Mm -hmm. Hologram again, again, again. Whew. Yeah, might as well go up. Doesn't look like there will be too much harm to it. Just gotta jump these. Jump them. With severe skill. Severe skill. And keep the hologram on so that no invisible spikes appear. Again, keep the hologram on. Save. Because I wouldn't trust you with my life. Laser right there. Whoa! 
Close call. Ha! <laughs> Jumped over that. Wait. Okay, blank, blank seven three four blank zero something something nine. I definitely need to write this down. Sorry, that last one was an eight, not a nine. My bad. Oh, and there's that maze above us, as it seems. Gotta navigate my way back. But, doesn't really matter, because it saved me there anyway. Aha! I knew not to trust that. Whew. Definitely would not trust that. Whew. Okay. Good, good. There we go. Now, maybe something to the left. How should I maneuver this? Like that. That works. Keep on going. And, yep. More of an ambush. Whew. Back to the four. Um, we have an invisible wall here, as it seems. So, I clearly need to go back down. Back down slowly. Good. Hey, 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 hey. Do you really need to do that? I can't go back down. Courtesy of the spiked enemy right there. What do I do now? What do I do now? Do I really have to restart this? So guess what I'm doing? I'm restarting this. Instead of going up there, I'm going to head to the right. Discover that the character over there is a one. Or, sorry. Character one is a six. Yeah. <sighs> Hover my mouse. Sometimes you can see that I have no background at all right there. The eight is another three. So we got repeating digits. Yeah. Why did I have to move my notepad over there? Okay. So now, actually looking at the screen again, over this way, wonder what I can find. So really, how am I supposed to get across that? Meh. I guess I can't, so let's go back up here. Unless, unless I forget where the double jump was, so I head back this way, I suppose. Climb up this. Nope. Over here was the hologram, and I forget the path again. Yeah, I'll probably. I do remember though. I think I do remember which one it was. Yep, it was that one. Second time around, easy enough. As long as you remember which light it was. Back this way. Well, I was only able to find seven of the characters, but at least I know seven of them. <clears throat> the nine is right there. One, two, three. Six remains unchanged. One, two, three, four. One, two, three. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. One, two, three, four, five, six. <clears throat> okay. So now, we have to guess what it's going to be for five and seven. One, two, four, five, six, seven. Yep. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Nope. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Nope. 
One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Nope. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Nope. One, two, three, four. Okay. So the five was a six and the seven was a four. All right. Hi, I'm Dr. Fosswat, however you pronounce that. I specialize in teleportation. I'll show you. Just watch the cat. Okay. See? Told ya. Jump in. Okay, I'll jump in. And I'll pick up the umbrella, too. And the eyeball. So it takes us back up there. I could use the purple key, though, so I'm gonna keep on searching for now. Also, I'm going to head on back this way. Already know the password once. And now that I have the double jump, I can make it across that, provided I turn the hologram on and... Yes. And I bother to avoid all enemies I can possibly avoid. If I'd be that smart. Okay, now I've got everything. Only now do we find out that that one character is a seven. Wait a minute, I'm glowing in blue. And only there do I find out that that character is a five. It's a trap. Jump, jump, jump. Yes, you're glowing red, I know, I know. Enemies are danger. So now that I've got absolutely everything, I guess I can just head back, maybe? Maybe? Yes, since I've got everything, I've got all four keys. And up we go. And so with the scientist's help, she escaped the worm's lair. She celebrated by eating a carrot sandwich. And a worm inside that one. How cruel.